guys, so today's video is going to be a brand new tag video and it's going to be called the Summer Lovin' Tag. Now there are quite a lot of seasonal videos on YouTube or seasonal tag videos and I've done quite a few of them, I really like doing them but I thought it would be fun to set up a brand new one for Summer 2014. So here we go, there are 10 questions and I'm going to get started now. So the first one is a summer lipstick you are loving and it's the one I'm wearing now but I'm not actually going to talk about a specific colour, it's more like a range of lipsticks that has just been launched or is about to launch in the UK and I've spoken about them a couple of times before, it's the Revlon Colour Stain Moisture Stain Glosses. I absolutely love the formula of these, they're like almost kind of like a gel they're really, really moisturising and they stay on your lips a long time. The colour selection is really pretty. The one I'm wearing at the moment is in India Intrigue. I actually picked this up when I was in LA last week. But they're about to launch in the UK and I would definitely re recommend getting your hands on one or numerous of the colours if you can because they're really, really nice. Um, and yeah, I'm just a massive fan of those. I'm going to be wearing them all summer long. Question number two is a summer nail polish you are loving. This is the one I'm wearing at the moment. I put it on on purpose, I'm not going to lie. Um, this is from Topshop, and I believe the name of it is Skip. I can't find any other word on it that would be the name except for Skip. Um, I actually got this last year, and I did wear it quite a lot last year, but I just seem to be reaching for it. Um, whenever I'm painting my nails, I just kind of reach for it. I don't know why. It's just a really, really pretty, flattering, bright pink. It's not quite neon. Um, it's definitely like not in the realm of the pastel -y, boring pink. There's just something about it that's really, really pretty. And the formulation is lovely as well. It's really opaque and creamy and nice to apply. And because it's Topshop, it's quite affordable too. I think these are £5 each. Number three is a bikini you're loving this summer. And this has to be my new bikini of the year. This one is from Sea Folly. I believe it's called the Belladonna. Um, bikini and this is the chartreuse colour. I had this in a haul video um, back in the springtime and I got loads of comments about it because um, I have learnt as I get older that investing in like more expensive bikinis is definitely worth it because they last so much longer and they're also a lot more flattering to wear in terms of cut. This is the top so it's a halter neck but it has um, like shaped cups. I also think Sea Folly are amazing. If you don't have big boobs, they just really give you a nice shape as well. Um, I really like that. And then I have the tie side bottoms, which were actually quite hard to find. I ended up ordering these separately because um, I always like wearing tie sides. But I just think it's such a cute design and a really bright colour for summer. So that is the bikini I'm going to be rocking all of this summer whenever I get the chance to actually go swimming because I bought that a couple of months ago and I still haven't worn it um, because I just haven't been by a pool really. Question number four is what is your favourite summer frappuccino from Starbucks? I actually have one here. Here's the one I made earlier. Um, Mike actually knew I was filming this video and I asked him to pick one of these up so I could show you guys. This is the mocha coconut frappuccino. OMG this is like totally amazing. I was actually obsessed with the mocha cookie crumble when that came out. I think it was last year. I had it in a monthly favourites then and I just really really loved it but this is even better because I'm obsessed with coconut if you guys watch my videos on a regular basis you'll notice that I kind of put coconut stuff in everything like I love coconut in body products in bath products in food um, I just generally love coconut so this is my favorite summer drink because it's chocolatey it's coffee -y, and it's coconutty at the same time and I went a bit naughty and got cream on the top as well because it's the only way to do it. Number five is what is your favourite fake tan? I actually did a video all about fake tan a couple of weeks ago, so I'm going to link it in the info bar below. But the one I've been using the most at the moment is the new Saint Tropez Express Tan. This is amazing because it allows you to put on your fake tan, wash it off in one, two or three hours depending on how dark you want to go, um, and then you don't have to smell like fake tan all day. I really like Saint Tropez, but it does smell. In my experience, it gives off like the best colour and it stays a really long time and this one is just really great because you don't have to smell like biscuits all day long which is always a bonus. Question number six is what is your favourite summer song or a summer song that you're loving and I know it's really predictable because it's been number one but I'm absolutely obsessed with Ed Sheeran's Sing at the moment and just generally his whole, whole new album because I really really like Ed Sheeran and it's been so long since his first album was released um, we've been like waiting for it. I say we, me and Mike are like big Ed Sheeran fans and we've been waiting for his new album. So I'm really, really loving that at the moment. I'm just basically playing it on repeat in my car. Number seven is what is your favourite summer accessory? And that's a really easy one for me because I'm totally obsessed with it. This is a little neon clutch that I picked up from Oliver Bonus. It's fully beaded, it's so cute. I actually 
um, prefer it without the chain strap but there is like a little silver chain strap that you can use as well it was fairly affordable I think it was 29 pounds but I can definitely see myself using this a lot this summer because it's just such a pretty clutch I really like it and I love the neon pink as well number eight is a summer fragrance you're loving and it's got to be the Jean Paul Gaultier I think this is just the Eau de Parfum Intense I'm not sure if this is limited limited edition or not but I absolutely love it my mum used to wear the original one of this um, when I was younger and so it kind of reminds me of her because it has like similar notes to it but I just really love it it's very very sweet and kind of sexy at the same time like it's not too sweet um, but I really like it and as you can see I've only had it for a few weeks and I've used up quite a lot but it comes in a sexy bottle as well with like a corset question number nine is what summer book are you loving at the moment and I'm actually back converted to using my Kindle again. I stopped using my Kindle for a while, I'm not really sure um, why. I think it was because I just had a few actual paper books that I wanted to read, but there are two books that I've been loving recently. Um, one of them is called The Husband's Secret, which I just finished a couple of weeks ago, which is really, really good. I really liked that one for a kind of like mystery, kind of drama, fiction. And then I've also been reading the Maze Runner series, which I know I'm so late to the game because the Maze Runner's been out for ages. I read the first one and I'm now onto the second one. I have to say the second one is so good. I definitely like the second one more than the first one. I think it's called The Scorch Trials, the second one. So that's what I'm reading at the moment and it's my summer read. And just generally I'm loving my Kindle again. I've just totally fallen back in love with it. The last question, question number 10, is what are you most looking forward to this summer? And for me, that's got to be going on holiday with my friends. I know I travel a lot and I get a lot of comments from you guys kind of asking about my travels and stuff, but most of the time the traveling I do um, is for YouTube or for work and therefore I don't often get to take or go away with all of my friends. So I'm really excited I'm going to be going away with, I think there's like eight of my friends coming um, in a few weeks time to Portugal and I'm just really really looking forward to kind of switching off and spending time with my friends and just like sunbathing and reading books and chilling out because a lot of the time when I go away for YouTube it's just so busy 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 filming um, and it's so much fun but I haven't actually been on like a beach holiday um, since my honeymoon so I'm really really excited about that and that's it for this video I really hope you guys enjoyed it if you want to make it then I tag all of you if you make videos but I'm going to tag a few specific people in the info bar below I really hope you're having an amazing amazing week and I will see you again next time bye guys hi guys and welcome back to my channel today we're doing a Sephora haul which I'm very excited about Woo! I'm here with Baxter she is my chum you know her don't you if you don't then you've been Watching. You've been away on holiday, she's always here with me. 